Elias, where are you? Tiggery, I'm right here. Why does it come back for me? Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. be at the train tracks in about two days. We're still doing that? I thought we agreed to go back to the survivor camp. Albany. These places are shitholes. Ravaged by bandits. We'd be eaten alive. But everywhere's a shithole, Elias. At least the camp's a safer shithole. But my brother's not there. There's no reason for us to go back. I've told you this hundreds of times. Dude, we've been searching for Diggory for a month. Maybe he doesn't want you to find him. I don't care. I'm going with or without you. That's fucking bullshit. Look, I didn't mean to upset you, but he might not even be alive. How long are we going to be searching before accepting- HE'S NOT DEAD! <laughs> He's at the tracks. We're close. I know it. He always used to go there when he needed to get away. He's there. Just because your sister's dead doesn't mean my brother is. I know you hate me now, but please come with me. We used to be friends, and when we find Diggory, the three, the three of us could start over. Find a safe place, with a nice view, it'll be worth it. I'll come. The uncertainty must be killing you. It's better to know than not to. And I don't hate you, by the way. I just hate that you keep risking our lives for your brothers. I'll always risk my life for Diggory, but risking yours is up to you. You idiot. Walking from place to place is getting to me. I feel like. But every step you take, I'm getting closer to him. It's getting to me too. Let's just find him. Same to me. Same fucked up world.
cares what the world looks like if you don't have the people that matter? I think what the world looks like matters most when you don't have those people. wanted to be, should have been. Growing up, I always took care of him when dad left for days. I took care of him. But recently, before the revolution tore this world apart, I wasn't there for him. I was too busy numbing my own pain, and we drifted apart. I should have been there for him. Don't beat yourself up about not being there for me. It's not your fault the world we know is gone. And you're here with me now. I mean, I'm stuck with you now, idiot. Alright, well, let's get going. Where are you? Hello? Hi. Hi? Uh, is this your brother? My brother? Are you a brother? Are you my brother? No. I was talking to the lady. No. Where'd you get that watch? What watch? That watch. I, uh... No. My brother had that. Diggory. That was his watch. Elias, I can't sleep. Diggory, you know the thunder won't hurt you, right? I know, I know. It's just too loud. I can't help it. Here. A watch. Listen to the ticking. It'll help you fall asleep. I think he was here yesterday. Yesterday? Yesterday? Yeah, yesterday. But can you take us to him? I can absolutely take you to him. I'm an excellent tracker. Do you trust this man? What well, the choice hey, do we have? Fuck yourself. Follow me. Right track. So this dude is using your scrawny arms are gonna protect us? Yep. We're here. But nobody's here. But there was someone who was here. I don't see anyone. They did the thing, right? Over there. Okay, where did they go? They went east. No, what direction? Left or right? Right? Of course I know where we're going. I don't know anything. I don't actually know anything about tracking at all. I've actually just been stalking them for the last couple of days. I just wanted to make some friends. Hey, shh! Do you guys hear that? Hey, Orange! 
Did you eat my last can of oranges? I didn't eat your stupid oranges. Else. You bitch! What am I now gonna have when I take my shots of vodka? Eat my ass. Well, you two shut up. It was me. I ate your stupid oranges. You ate my last can of oranges! Hey, guys. Why, if it isn't the troll from under the bridge. Get lost, or get me some oranges. Oranges seem to be in a very short supply recently. That's why you ate five cans of it in one night. Hold up! Who the hell are those two clowns hiding behind that tree? Glenn, you didn't bring back up to off us, did you? We're looking for your friend. What friend? Diggory. Oh, the handsome guy. What a hug. Yeah, he left yesterday. Guess he had better things to do. So, what do you punks want with Diggory? He's Elias's brother. Ooh, brothers, huh? I can see the resemblance. Although, you know, match for your brother, hot shot. That's what I said. How rude of me. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Gertrude. Hello, Diggory's brother. I'm Igor, nobody's brother. The name's Victor. You guys are welcome to join our camp for the night. We know how to have fun. It's gonna be sundown soon. Better to stay in a group than alone. Friends. I'm so glad we could have this bonding experience together. What is going on up there, you freak? Right here. At any given moment, I can have my own complex thoughts. Sometimes, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> I've never had alcohol before. Can't wait to try it. Thanks. Oh, Gertrude, you have the same lovely smile as Glenn. <laughs> Do you trust these people? It's hard to trust anyone these days. But they know Diggory. I'm telling you, something's not right. Just keep your eyes open. Diggory's brother, huh? Yeah, he'd been with us for a while. Why did he leave? Conflict of interest, brother. Middle of the night, he heads up the mountain. Who knows what's up there? We'll find out tomorrow. Two brothers, searching for each other. What's your story, toots? You haven't been saying much of anything. I watched my sister get impaled through the chest and die. How's that for a story? Well, uh, you know, I was thinking more of a lighthearted story. Gotta go. Glenn! You bastard! <laughs> what are you gonna do? Don't touch her. You're gonna defend your girlfriend with a little stick. Victor, kill that bitch! Get away! 
Hey, come on! We're safe. They're not gonna follow us here. You don't look so good. Thanks. I just need a little rest. You're gonna need a lot more than that. Digger will patch you up when we get to him. I don't think we're gonna make it to Diggory. You're not giving up. We're so close. No. I meant I'm not gonna make it to Diggory. You're right. You're in no shape. I'll go get Diggory and bring him right back to you. Elias, by the time you find him, I'll be long dead. You know that. And it's all right. No, I'm sure he's right there. He'll help you. How do you still believe what those bandits told you? How can you think that he's right here? Those bastard bandits! I'm sorry I got you into this mess. You shouldn't be bleeding. None of this should be happening. You and I were supposed to find him together. I was supposed to take care of you. That's rich. The only thing you were taking care of was the idea that your brother was alive. But... You were... You were able to keep hope, even in the darkest of times. I wish I could have done that. It's all right. I was gonna die soon anyway. Couldn't keep living without my sister, you know? Maybe hope is what keeps you alive through all this. But there is still hope. You've made it this far with me. You must resent me, but I never stopped being your friend. You idiot. I don't resent you. I never have. Come on. I told you, I won't No, be... not Diggory. Let's find you a nice view. Idiot! Do you want your food or not? It's getting cold! It's always cold. <sighs> Told you we'd find a nice view!
Diggory? Getting warmer. Diggory? <laughs> Diggory? I've been looking everywhere for you. I thought we were playing hide and seek. Maybe you were, but I wasn't. I almost had a heart attack, Diggory. You can't go disappearing like that. Sorry, Elias. I thought it was a game. It's okay. I was just worried. Let's go home. Wait, no! Come back! Found you. Oh man. Thought I found a nice hiding spot this time. That's what you thought. It don't matter for my seeking skills. We'll, we'll see about that. It's my turn now. One, two, three, ten. Elias? Dick Diggory?